welcome to in jamaica and if this is your first time here please subscribe click the notification bell and stick around to see places in jamaica currently we are driving west on ocean boulevard at the waterfront by kingston arbor heading towards parade square making the left off Ocean Boulevard onto King Street. To the left is Tax Administration Downtown Office. This video is aimed at giving you a general overview. I will be driving around Downtown Kingston, pointing out some of the major places. On the left is Department of Correctional Services. Jamaica Customs Agency Corporate Office is on the right. Just a reminder, we are now driving on King Street heading towards Parade Square and we are at the Port Royal Street intersection. Port Royal Street is a one way going left, which is west. This is the Arbor Street intersection. Arbor Street is a one way going right, which is east. Here is the Water Lane intersection, and it is a one way going left, which is west. Additionally, Arbor Street, which we have passed earlier, can take us to Arbor View, St. Thomas, the Norman Manley International Airport, and also to Port Royal. We are now at the Tower Street intersection and Tower Street is a one way going right which is east. Here on the right is the Supreme Court and on the left is the Court of Appeal. We have reached the Barry Street intersection. Barry Street is a one way going left which is west. On the right is Kingston Parish Church. The left here takes you into South Parade bus stop. We have reached the heart of downtown Kingston, which is Parade Square. And just ahead is St. William's Grand Park. We have made the left of King Street onto South Parade. On the left is another view of South Parade bus stop, same as a bus station. The road to the extreme left is Arian Street and Arian Street is a one way running north which is right and continues towards Crossroad. We have now made the right of South Parade onto West Parade. So we are driving on West Parade and the road to the extreme left is West Queen Street and West Queen Street takes you to Coronation Market. We'll be going towards the Coronation Market in a bit. On the right is St. William's Grand Park. Notably, St. William's Grand Park is the park that sits in the middle of downtown Kingston. The road ahead to the left is the continuation of Orion Street. Orion Street continues off West Parade and goes straight towards crossroads. We are now making the right of West Parade onto North Parade. On the left is North Parade bus station. To the left is King Street. 
and King Street is a one way running south. Additionally, to the left is the Ward Theatre, and the right is the main entrance to St. William's Grand Park. The St. William's Grand Park is named after William Grant. William Wellington Wilwood Grant, O.D., born 1894 and died 27th of August 1977 at age 83, was a Jamaican labor activist. He was called St. William's Grant, Saint stands for Sergeant, as he was in a military service. On the left is Love Lane. On the left in the corner is Church Street and Church Street is a one way running left which is north. The building to the left is Coke Memorial Methodist Church. So we are now on East Parade and to the left is East Queen Street. On the left is the other end of Church Street and it is a one way going south which is in that direction also on the left is the Pernell Charles Arcade we are back at South Parade and to the right is the south entrance to St. William's Grand Park and we'll be making the left down back down King Street so let's continue with St. William's Grant St. William's Grant was a black man and is considered the one who began the struggle of the working class in Jamaica and entrusted Alexander Bustamante with the responsibility of taking the struggles of the working class to the next level. The St. William's Grant Park is named in honor of him, William Grant. It was previously called Victoria Park in honor of Queen Victoria of England being renamed shortly after Grant's death. We are now quickly making our way down King Street to make the right onto Barry Street. Making the right from King Street onto Barry Street. Peters Lane intersection. We are approaching Orion Street. We'll be making the right up Orion Street, which is north. Well, Orion Street is a one way going north, so you can only go right. So currently we are driving north on Orange Street. Notably, in general, downtown Kingston is very busy and this video may not have been possible if it was done on a Sunday. On Fridays and Saturdays, downtown Kingston is extremely busy and road such as Beckford Street in particular is impossible to vehicular traffic due to street side vending. On the left is Beckford Street. I want to make a left onto Beckford Street and today is Sunday but the road is still impassable due to street side vending. So we'll choose a new route from West Queen Street direction to get to Beckford Street. We are back at West Parade, traveling north. We are now making the left of West Parade onto West Queen Street. This is Luke Lane intersection. This is Princess Street intersection. Princess Street is a one way going left which is south. 
This is Matthews Lane intersection, popularly known as Matches Lane. We have reached West Street. The right will take us towards Awood Street, but we are making the left onto West Street towards Beckford Street. The entire area here extending to the right is referred to as a downtown market. West Street continues ahead, but the road changes into a one-way coming this direction, so you can't drive down that road. On the left is Beckford Street. Beckford Street is a one-way going right, so we are making the right onto Beckford Street. This is Peachan Street and Beckford Street intersection. The left on Peachan Street can take you to the old railway station by Darling Street and also to the downtown Kingston waterfront. On the left is the Darling Street Police Station. Also on the left is the Rural Bus Terminus, popularly known as the Country Bus Park. We have reached the end of Beckford Street and ahead is Darling Street. Just ahead, slight left, is the Edward Siaga Mini Stadium, same as the Edward Siaga Sports Complex. On the left is Tivoli Gardens community and on the right is the Coronation Market. The Coronation Market is the largest farmers market in the Caribbean. The Tivoli Gardens community here on the left is famed for the 2010 Tivoli incursion. On the 24th of May 2010 the security forces stormed into the Tivoli Gardens community. Their aim was to restore state authority in this part of Kingston and to arrest Christopher Duduskok, who was wanted for extradition to the United States on drugs and armed trafficking charges. Darling Street ends here and we are making the left onto Spanish Town Road. Additionally, just ahead to the right is Chestnut Lane. The road to the immediate left here is the Bustamante Highway. We are now on Spanish Town Road heading northwest. The road to the right is Regent Street. Beeston Street is also here to the right. On the right is Bread Lane. Charles Street is on the right. Milk Lane is on the right. Crossing the Tivoli Gully. We are still on Spanish Town Road. North Street is on the right. On the right is Denham Town High School as well as the Denham Town Primary School. The road to the left is Industrial Terrace and the road on the right is Albert Street. Also on the right is the Denham Town Police Station. Additionally, 
to the left on industrial terrace you can find the Tivoli Gardens High School on the right is Water Street also on the right is Little King Street on the left is the Maypen Cemetery The road on the right is Collis Smith Drive. Collis Smith Drive can take you into Trenchtown community. There you will find Trenchtown Culture Yard Museum, which is Bob Marley's former home. On the right, we are passing Trenchtown Fire Station. On the right, we are passing West Road. The building on the left is Arisa Raman Center. This is a prison. We are leaving Kingston going into St. Andrew Parish. The trip won't be very detailed, but enjoy the view. The road to the left will take you to St. Andrew Technical High School. Ari Street and Tirari Crescent is on the right. Additionally, on the right is Rose Town. On the left is the Old Majestic Theatre. Just ahead, at the intersection, the road to the left is East Avenue and the road to the right is Maxfield Avenue. Along East Avenue, that is on the left, you can find Greenwich Town. Passing West Avenue on the left. The road to the immediate right here is Ashley Road, and the road just ahead to the right is Waltham Park Road.
on the left we are passing Dela Cree Park The road on the right is Oakland Road. The road on the left is Development Road. We are approaching the Three Miles Overhead Bridge. The bridge is located at Three Miles, which is the same as the Porsche Simpson Miller Square. The road on the left is Bell Road. The left here will take you onto Marcus Garvey Drive, which can take you back into downtown Kingston, as well as to Portmore in St. Catherine Parish via Toll Road. We are driving on the southeast to the northwest leg of the bridge. Above is the southwest to northeast leg. Notably, there is an exit beneath the bridge that will take you northeast on Agri Park Road, which can take you into halfway tree. We are now en route to six miles. On the left is Jamaica Biscuit Company Limited. On the left is Red Stripe Bottling Plant. On the right is Toyota Jamaica Limited. Please remember to subscribe to In Jamaica. Give us a like and share and thank you all for watching.